Okay, well, so you want me to talk about this show, Oceans. Uh, I, live in, I live in Saskatoon, which is a great place for painters. There's many uh, important painters who come out of Saskatoon, and many of them are my, are my friends. And uh, I paint the prairies uh, a lot. But we come uh, visit Victoria often in the winter to get away from the, the, the winters in Saskatchewan. And that, uh, recently, especially, I've uh, wondered about how I could paint the ocean, uh, which I've come to love. And uh, uh, I started doing a lot of small paintings. I've, I've always painted it a little bit, but I started uh, about a year or two ago, I started painting a lot of small paintings of no, oceans, I'm often in stormy not. situations and things like that, uh, just to see if I could. And then uh, after a while, I found that I was having some success and wanted to paint it more and more and more. So uh, I, you know, that's one of the reasons that these particular paintings came about. The other thing that I find, uh, say about myself, is that I've learned a lot uh, from abstract painters. I don't abstract from nature like a lot of painters have since the Second World War anyway. But I have learned an awful lot about how to paint and how to put pictures together and so forth from abstract painters, especially some American uh, painters and some uh, uh, Saskatchewan painters too. And uh, that has affected the way I paint the paintings. I mean, uh, they have a lot to do with color and with paint handling. And in a way, they're very minimal. You know, they don't have a lot of kind of subject, traditional subject matter in them. And uh, I just let the whole overall scene take care of itself with the, you know, a lot of, without a lot of compositional devices in it. You know? And I think that's another thing that is characteristic of the paintings. And I guess if, when you get right down to it, I try to make the paint give the impression, the way I handle the paint give the impression of the surface of the sea and the surface of the sky and things like that. So when you get right down to it, uh, that's what it's all about. I guess one other thing I guess I'd say is that I use uh, color uh, to give the impression of light. And I, the horizon means a lot in these paintings. It seems to be a very minimal part of the painting, but it's a very important part of the painting. And that's about all there is to it. I, I, I hope people enjoy them, and some people seem to, and that pleases me enormously because uh, I want to give that kind of pleasure to people.